and a uh, harlequin is just a protein one little protein but it's not from a whole different bloodline okay. like the fawn is from a completely different bloodline so Fawns if i wanted and, more if i wanted more lazy dane what, what color would it, what color should i go with i'd go with a fawn yeah yeah i like the lazy i like the lazy big dogs he's he's laid back i mean some of the fawns have energy and i can get him going he he runs like crazy yeah. but he's not just zooming all over the place yeah um, where my harlequin that i had he was very high energy he just didn't know what to do next now a blue great dane i know somebody that had a blue oh and I, I like am, those too they're like a shimmering kind yeah, of a gray. yeah 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 that dog almost like a pit bull color huh this dog was always half spent half the time jumping up in the air and i'll never forget this we were on a walk one time and i says where's your dog she says oh the dog's name was zora Zora's up on that tree limb. I look up, the dog climbed a tree. What? It, I'm not kidding, the dog climbed a tree. <laughs> I've never seen anything like that. But that was the highest energy dog I've ever wow. seen, was the blue. Wow, okay, well, I, want, I, like, I don't want blue. That's, that's good, but for what I want, I want, a, I want low energy. The fawn is really mellow. Okay. Now he's really trained. You know, if you notice some of the other dogs, the dogs, they're running around having a great time. Cash is like, I'll check you out. And I'm going to kind of watch from here. Uh huh, uh huh. You know, and it's, it's just each dog has its own individual personality. But when he right, was trained right. as a show dog, you know, they don't want him running all over the place. They want him mellow. Right. So a lot of it is going back to his training. He's trying to break out of it, huh? I'm trying to. trying, but he's just, that's, that's, he's, he's at his social. Yeah, he's at his, he's at his, uh, you know, at if, his push. if he's with a bunch of other dogs, he thinks he's at the dog show. Right. So he thinks he needs to stack up, and he's waiting for the handler oh, he's to. Stacking, he's stacking right now. I yeah, see, so I, he... saw him, I saw him stacking earlier. Yeah, so I didn't know what he was doing. He figures the handler's gonna come take me and parade me around the ring anytime now. So, <laughs> <laughs> so I'm trying to let him know he's retired from showing. You know, because you can't show them once they're fixed. Now he did take, he got all the way to champion, uh -huh. and you know, I obviously can't show him anymore. Or I would, I would have taken him to grand champion, but he's sired 23 puppies, what? and the breeder has frozen DNA on him. So the breeder said there will be more cash puppies. Oh wow! You know, but uh, of course it's going to be done, you know, with artificial insemination. But um, so he's not done making puppies. Right. It's just the work is done. <laughs> That's a cool story on him, man. Yeah, he's uh, and he's I, I, a see, dog. I see him posing now that you tell me, now that you said he's like posing. Yeah, I see him posing. Would he, would he be scared? Would he, would he mind if I pet him? No, go right ahead. Oh, absolutely. Hello, Cassius. Hello, Cassius. Yeah. His full name is Cash 2.0, but we Cash just call him Cash. You're looking good. You look real good. Yeah, you do. You look good. You look real good. Yeah, I see. You don't have to bend over to pet him. <laughs> so good. Yeah. Yeah, good. <laughs> oh, sure. So good. So, do you think that the uh, Great Dane has two different versions of them, um, makeup-wise? Well, there's different bloodlines. Yeah. It just depends on how they're bred. Yeah. Now, so, the I, more work, harlequins have seen come with more working dogs, or what? Well, as far as working dogs, that's going way back in history when they pulled mining carts and hunted wild boar. Yeah. Uh, basically, what they do now is they're, they're basically pets. Right. I mean, I'm, there are some Great Danes that people will pull carts with them but it's more for show than anything else right um but i mean i once put on some roller blades and i wanted to see if he'd pull them and he looked at me like you can file that under things that aren't going to happen <laughs> it was swift fuck you <laughs> you kissed my ass that's funny <laughs> they do stuff like that and that's so yeah. funny you know i used to i used to put uh i used to put mint in my dog's water you know uh -huh. mint leaves right she got used to it and i got busy you know one day i didn't put, put a mint leaf in there and she went over to the bushes threw it in there herself wow that's amazing <laughs> 
I know somebody that trained their Great Dane to open the refrigerator door and they regretted that. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, so I would became self-service. Right. <laughs> now, some people think it's cute to have them push on the ice maker. I don't, I don't let them do that. No. That's something I don't want them to do. Why would they want him to push on the ice maker? Well, so he can get himself ice. They, just, they love ice. Uh, but I don't want them doing the self-service thing. They'll make a mess. Right. And they, 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 sometimes they don't know when they don't know when there's enough anyway. You got to monitor that stuff for them. Yeah, they're smart. Great Danes are pretty smart. Some, like sometimes it's hard to tell. You just see them standing there. But uh, my last one used to watch TV. And I don't mean he just looked at it for the flickering images. He knew. He would see commercials come on that had dogs. It was a Subaru commercial. Uh -huh. And I remember, and he would stay. As soon as he saw the commercial come on, there's no dog yet. He'd go up to the TV and he'd have his snout right in the spot where he knew that dog was going to appear. And then when it did, he went into a barking frenzy. <laughs> now, this one hardly barks. you got to have like a doorbell or knock on the door right? to get him to bark. He's barking at the TV. That's his entertainment. So he was actually watching it. Yeah, he was actually watching it. Yeah. He knew when it was coming. He's yep. Like, all right, this is the commercial. Subaru, all right, move. Yep, he knew. <laughs> Don't the windows, windows.